Welcome students. Today I'm going to show you how to find resources for your evaluation essay. Once you are at the open LMS, I'm going to have you navigate to where it says course resources on the left hand menu. From here, scroll down until you find the MCC library link. Click on that and you're brought to the library homepage. From here, scroll down to you'll find databases and resources. Go ahead and click on that. On the right are the most popular databases that the library has available for searching. My personal favorite is NC Live. Why? Because it's actually a collection of databases. So you really, you're getting the best of all worlds. From here, I'm gonna go ahead and search for my topic, but I'm gonna use very specific keywords and Boolean operators to get the best search results possible. Let's say that I'm investigating the movie, The Princess Bride. I'm gonna go ahead and put the name of my topic in quotes to start. I'm then gonna use the Boolean operator and to get more specific with what I'm looking for. Now, The Princess Bride is also a book in addition to being a movie. So I wanna make sure that I'm only getting movie reviews. I'm then gonna specify it even more and only search for reviews. So that is what the entire search bar looks like. And I encourage you to do the same when looking for your sources. I'm gonna hit enter. It's gonna take its sweet time giving me this main menu. Now, if I look at the top, scholarly articles aren't really what I'm looking for for this particular essay. Instead, I want reviews, which can mostly be found with news and magazine articles. Here I have a couple that I could potentially use, but the one that captures my attention the most is down here at the bottom. Why? because The Princess Bride was released in 1987. So I know that this is a fresh review for that time. I'm gonna click on that. And it is then gonna bring me to the article itself that was published in the St. Petersburg Times. Alrighty, here it is. So the title of the article where it was published and the date it was published. All right, all that good stuff that you need for your MLA citation. Here, the, I have the article written in full and I can pull certain quotes from it to use in my essay to create a better analysis. I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to shoot me an email. Otherwise, I look forward to reading your essays.